Hey guys, Hal here. Uh, in this video we're going to be installing, no we're not going to be installing, we're going to be extracting uh, an area of the world into a prefab using the editor. Uh, so I'm not going to go through how to set up the editor, I'm going to assume that you've already got it installed. Uh, you'll need to have the dedicated server DLL installed in the dedicated server for this to work. Um, and this is how you do it. So start up your game, connect to your dedicated server. For this example, yet again, I'm going to be using Lasman's Walking Dead Prison because it's friggin' awesome. Uh, let's just switch on debug mode. I'm not going to show you the prefab because if you haven't seen it, I'm not going to spoil anything, but it's well worth the download. So what you want to do is go to an area of the world that you want to export, go and stand somewhere near the middle of it, and into the chat you type BBB claim and then the name of the area you want to claim I'm going to call it prison and then you should see a little message come up here and that's the server telling you that uh, it saved this area for you if you've got errors then you'll have to deal with those but if everything goes well that's what you'll see uh, so now if the prefab you had was quite a small one less than uh, I think 33 by 33 blocks if you go uh, BBB X and then the name of the claim you've just made so prison and then wait for it to come back saying it's been exported and it tells you where to find it uh, if you open up the prefab editor go to file load exported area and then you want to find where you keep the files so I've gone in seven days, die, random, daddy game. Now my mod creates a new folder called block backup and in there is a folder called users and in there is my user and in there is the exported prefab or exported file of the uh, prison claim area. Uh, yeah, it's just telling you that you know I've, I've done this once already, so it's just saying that there's a prefab that it's going to overwrite in the prefab folder. So I'm just going to agree. And if you scroll up to ground level, there is an area of the prefab. But unfortunately, it's too small at the minute. So uh, what we're going to do is just increase the size of it. So if you come out of the prefab bit and go to Backup Manager and then load up the uh, dedicated world you'll find that you can see that the uh, prison area is listed there and here we can change the defaults. Now uh, normally what you do is just run to the uh, southeast corner, no southwest corner and go and see where the location is, go to the northwest corner, no, northeast, whatever, uh, get that one and that works out the minimum and maximum size of the area. So I've already done that, so rather than waste your time, I'm just going to put the values in. So once we've uh, set it to how big we want to be, we want to update the area and then click save player and what you should get in game is this little message saying reloading and reloading complete so that's just the server refreshing itself and um, knowing about the new claim size so if we uh, oops, BBB X prison again and this is going to take a little bit longer because we've made the claim a lot bigger Still waiting. Okay, I actually paused the video there because that was taking ages. Uh, I'll look into that, it doesn't usually take so long. But it is quite a big prefab, so uh, just be aware that 
if it is a huge one you're trying to export, it can take some time. Don't run the command again until you see either the exported to whatever or an error message. Um, <coughs> so now that's done, we can go back to the editor and just load the exported area again. So you notice the file size is a lot bigger now. Uh, yep, we do. And if we zoom out, we can see where's the zoom. We can see the area is a lot bigger now. Can't see. Ah, uh, click. There we go. Uh, so jump up to 70, and there we have it. There is the whole prefab. Uh, so what you want to do next is find out where the bottom of your prefab is. So this is the ground underneath it, and this is where it kicks in on level 64. And we're just going to remove the layers underneath it. So from 0 to 64. And then same again, we're going to find the top where nothing else is there, and that's level 33. So remove layers 33 to oh, wait, let's just put in a massive thing. And does it error? Oh, it does. Uh, so top one 190. I couldn't work it out. Uh, so 33 to 190. Okay, so there we have it. Uh, let's just zoom out a little bit more there so we can see it all. One final thing, um, if you go over the size of the area that you want to claim or you want to trim it down, you can use the remove left, right, top and bottom columns or by pressing F5, F6, F7 or F8. And what that does is just trim the area down. to the size you want. So now we're happy with that, that's all the prefab and nothing but the prefab. We're going to go file, save as and just call it whatever you want. I'm going to call it prison again but just to show you. Yep, and that's it. You can now save this for if we have to go through another conversion process or share it on the community or um, just take a backup if, you're, uh, if you've got a big build or something. So yeah, cheers guys, have fun.